In this video, I am going to show you how you can set up TikTok Pixel in your WordPress website using Google Tag Manager. Hi, my name is Nasim and you are welcome to this video. I love to share my experience and teach people how to build skills and make money from home. I am a top rated freelancer on Upwork and I have 5 years experience on web analytics. So if you are facing any problem with your web analytics, you can contact me. I will help you. Let's drive in here. This is my WordPress WooCommerce website and I want to install TikTok Pixel on this website. So I will use Google Tag Manager to do that. So first of all, I have to make sure this website is already connected with Google Tag Manager or not. So you can do it easily using a Google Tag Assistant legacy extension. So I am using Google Chrome web browser and this is the extension you can easily download it if you search on google then you can uh, get this link and you can see this is my tag manager container and this is my tag code and i have to make sure this exact same code or not here you can see this is exact same code so that's mean my website is connected with this tag manager container and then we need a TikTok pixel. So if you go on your TikTok ad manager, then you can see your assets. And then you can see I already make a pixel. And if you uh, don't have any pixel, you can easily make it. Just click on setup web event and, and give your pixel name. I am inputting it's a test and it's a TikTok pixel and click on next and i am i always i prefer manual install pixel code and click on next and get the custom code and here it is your pixel is already installed just uh, you have to copy it and you have to uh, connect it in your website so i am go back my event again because i want to use my another pixel which is a fast one so i'm going to open this pixel and then click on settings and then you will see the base code just i am going to copy this base code and then i am going to tag manager container and then so first of all uh, i have to make a tag so for making tag i'm going to click on new and tag configuration and first of all the easiest way to search um, any uh, template so here is a lot of template uh, already made it you have to click on discover then you have to find the tiktok gallery and you have to search tiktok and here it is uh, i am going to install it it's a tiktok template so if you want you can you know only input your a little tiktok code uh, that you will see uh, from here uh, so i'm click on got it and this one so if you want you can simply only copy this code and you can and you can input it here and you have to set up trigger for all pages because it's a base code and you have to uh, install uh, this code for all pages so that's why i am going to uh, select the all page trigger and give it a name here it's a tiktok base configuration and i'm going to save it also you can use full code just click on view base code and copy this code and go to tag manager and make new tag and tag will be you have to select custom html just paste it here and trigger will be all page so you can follow anyone like if you want to use full code then you can use custom html or you can choose the template and of course you have to publish after uh, making your tag and then let's check it so we have to go the workspace and go to preview and you have to give 
your full uh, website URL here and then continue and here you can see your website will automatically open and uh, see your container also loading so it's successfully connected and see our base configuration has fired so that means it's working also you can uh, check it through this another chrome extension which is tiktok help um, pixel helper 2.0 and you can see our page view event is coming here so that's mean it's successfully connected with your website and the pixel event so if you need any help to install facebook pixel you can contact me also so it's a standard woocommerce website and i uh, must i need to get the standard event which is view card add to cart view items purchase etc and next couple of video i will make based on this video so, so if you want to stay up to date then consider subscribing this channel that's all for today if you found this video helpful don't forget to give thumbs up and if you want to stay up to date then consider subscribing to this channel because every time i am publishing useful video on my youtube channel i will see you on the next video till then bye have a good day